Yo, what is up, everybody? How's it going? It's Lit, and welcome to Retro Bowl. I saw this game on the App Store, and it looked pretty interesting, so I decided why not to give it a shot here on the channel, especially with the NFL draft going on. Um, so yeah, let's hop into it. New game, save one. I think we just gotta click that, but yeah, let's hop into it here. Welcome to Retro Bowl. You are about to start your pro season as the head coach of a pro football team. Hopefully, we get that uh, fat contract as well. But the path to success is an ar arduous, an arduous one. But if you believe in yourself and can inspire your team, then glory awaits. That's a, that's a pretty damn big word there for a retro bowl. Ardu arduous. I'm probably probably not even pronouncing that word right. All right, first name. Uh, what what should we name ourselves? What should we name ourselves? Um, let's do lit. And do we need a last name, or can we can we change that? NFC, my favorite team is the Bears. Pain. Um, I don't, I don't need to start with my favorite team. No, okay, we don't need to have a last name. Nice. All right, we'll just be lit. All right, uh, we got some news here. With just one week left in the regular season, Houston have appointed Lit Wallow. Oh, they gave me a last name, Wallow. Yeah, we're gonna be wallowing this season. But we're the new head coach of the Houston Texans. Interesting. Wallow has worked at the college level for several years and was excelling as a head coach of Virginia Tech before taking the reins at Houston. Interesting, with the Hokies. Hokey pokey, huh? All right, let's hop into it. Welcome to Houston. This is your home screen. You can tap on the division table to view divisions in the schedule. When you're ready, tap the F office button. Okay, we won't skip the tutorial mostly because I've never played this game, but this actually looks super cool. Um, I did play a little bit of, uh, you know, the Retro Bowl on the, uh, I think it was N64 that had that game. Uh, Bo Jackson was a freaking monster in that game. But wow. Houston had a, I think, oh, wow, this is actually pretty accurate from last season, I believe, at least for for, uh, for standings. But let's hop here, hop into the front office and continue this tutorial here. Uh, from the front office, you can upgrade the facilities and staff. Tapping the an eye icon will bring up useful information. All right. So offensive coordinators, we got Quinn and Oat. Oh, we got a female defensive coordinator. That's that's groundbreaking. Unfortunately, she's only half a star. Retro Bowl doing her dirty. But let's see here. We got we got a lot of cap space actually. Morale is pretty high. Stadium training facilities and the rehab facilities are all kind of ass right now. <laughs> um, but we do have a little bit of those coins um, to upgrade some of them. But let's meet our roster first. Um, so let's click on the roster screen. Check it out. Uh, these are your key players. You don't need to manage the entire roster. You just take care of these guys and everyone else will fall into the line. Tap on the players to open his profile. Okay. So I guess the most important players. So we got Lamb, a two and a half star. Uh, running back is Holland, Fuller, two star, wide receiver. Gaines is a star and a half defensive lineman. And then Garland is a two star kicker. We're going to be kicking field goals from everywhere. All right, uh, here you can view players' details and attributes. Keep an eye on morale and condition. Poor morale can lead to game penalties and problems off the field. Low condition can lead to injuries or worse. Fumbles. Hopefully no fumbles here. We got to have some ball security. Let's try to keep the off the field, off the field issues to a minimum as well. But here we got Byron Lamb. Throw accuracy is crazy. He's got crazy good stand -away. He's really slow though. And he's already reached his potential because his rating is two and a half star and his potential is two and a half stars. So not great. He's got good morale though. Pretty decent contract, but he is also extremely old. So we're definitely gonna have to draft a quarterback here because this man's looking like damn Tom Brady. And this dude's only a two and a half star. But okay. Hop back in. Uh, before we head into a game, let's go over the basics for controlling your players on the field. All right. So ooh, there's a Hall of Fame also, but we'll go to that later but okay let's hop into this first up passing uh drag your finger in the opposite direction of the running receiver to aim then release to throw all right my phone is kind of cracked so i hope that doesn't affect this at all um so drag your finger in the opposite direction of that they're running so backwards okay i i've got the motion down i've got the motion down but now it's but now we actually got to hit this dude. 
Okay, that's that was too little now. Too much and too little. We got to find a balance here. I feel like I'm going to be... We're going to need some work here. All right, we're also just... We're, we're doing it too quick. I think we got it, but we just got to... Cut in. Why? What? Okay, now, I, now, I'm, now I'm just confused because I thought that was... All right, finally, now we got it. All right, now we got it. Now we got it. All right, excellent. This time the quarterback will drop back with the ball slightly. Okay. So he's running backwards a little bit. Boom. All right, now we've got it. Now we've got it. All right. All right, nice. Uh, at the start of each play, you can hand the ball off to your running back by tapping the blue circle. Swiping up or down while running will perform a sidestep, or you can swipe up to slow up. I'm not actually sure why you would want to slow up. We're, we're, all, we're all gas, no brakes over here on this team. Uh, so tap the blue circle. Swipe to... Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah, that was a little bit of an L. All right, now, okay. We, we gotta get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. There we go. Easy peasy. A little bit of showboating to get into the end zone, but well done. You can also run with the quarterback. You can do this by attempting to throw the ball backwards. Once he is running, you can swipe forwards to dive. All right. So is it like, oh, okay. And we'll dive into the end zone. Touchdown, I think, hopefully. Great, diving can help you reach for a first down or a touchdown. It also protects against a fumble. All right, finally kicking two all-time taps and the ball will fly through the uprights. All right. No good. Oh. All right. I think we... I think that... Ah, that's going to be no good either. We are struggling. All right. Good. All right. Now this is good. It's good. Nice kick. Remember the goalposts are the same width as the hash marks on the field. You can use the faint triangle on the ground as a guy. That's what I was trying to do. But it is... Uh, it was a struggle. All right. So we got... All right. Max... Max, Max, boom, it's good, it's good, 34, that's only a 34 yarder, that's got me sweating, I thought that was like a 50 yarder, <laughs> alright, well done, you have taken a ch taken charge of the Houston near the end of a difficult season, just enough time to get a hang of things before next season starts, the Houston, dev the Houston fans are desperate for you to turn things around, good luck, I need it, alright, a Houston rebuild here is the, I think, that looks like what we're going to be doing in these episodes here. We're going to be trying to rebuild. Um, so we've got a lot of a lot of work to do. And actually, I think we... Uh, for some reason, I think we're playing 17 games. So I think we're going to play one game here against the Indianapolis Colts at the top of the division. The top team. So, yeah. Let's hop into it. Let's play it. Let's play our first game. I think they're still going to be doing a little bit of a tutorial, but let's finish this season off and get ready. Well, let's just see how, how our team is. Let's see if there's anybody that maybe we want to. All right, so we've got the ball here. I haven't played any defense, but let's see if. Uh... All right. How do we. Oh. Two yards. We got two yards. All right. That was a. Uh... That was a bad play, to be completely honest. Um, okay, so you, now I'm kind of understanding how we got to go here. But we've got... Um, let's try to hit this tight end here. Actually... Ooh! Five yards. Nice. Nice play there, actually. So, we got a nice five-yard rushing play there. Let's see. Uh, I kind of want to run, but I think we should pass. I think we got to hit this guy... Hitting the sidelines. Oh, geez. Three yards for the first. All right, I kind of messed that up. I accidentally swiped backwards. Fourth down. Let's just give it to our easy, easy first down right there on fourth and inches. I honestly thought we had the, the first down there with the, the QB run. Okay, I am... I keep messing this up. This is like... All right, I'm obviously swiping the wrong direction to pass because I've tried to pass. Oh, we are hitting BF right there 
on the out. And again, we messed it up. At least our line is pretty decent. I, I don't know. Like I keep trying to swipe backwards, but I guess we got to swipe. Or... All right, finally we got... And it's going to be an interception. That was a the first pass we try to throw. We just throw a pick. That's not even that's not even Byron's fault. That's straight up just on me. That was a horrible decision making. Damn, I'm about to get fired. Indianapolis has possession. The quarterback throws it incomplete. All right. So I guess we actually don't play defense. All right, so all right, no defense, so it's all offense. So that we really gotta work on that. Um, let's actually hit the oh, two yards there. We are, we're slow and steady, slow and steady. But all right, now I got it. Way overthrown. I am all right. We're throwing it again. Oh, that's jeez. I I'm not sure what happened there. Um, I think we got a punt. We got a punt. So we're we're in our own own half. That was so dumb. I I fat fingered the running back there when we had a pretty decent chance for a nice a nice completion there. But let's continue on here. They throw the ball and it's gonna be we got it on the twenty four touchdown. Big mistake there. Maybe we should have got an ingress because they scored anyways, but. We got it in our own half. That's a good return. Houston has possession on our own 21-yard line here. Uh, and we're going to hit. Where did... I? All right. I think we, we're just going to be a running team. We're going to... Ooh. Ooh. We almost had him there. We, we're having a little bit of success. All right. I'm not... I'm not sure what's happening with my, my throwing here. We're going to go for it on fourth down. All right, we finally got one caught, but it's going to be sh short. Damn. We finally get a pass off and a... Uh... Yeah, it's not looking good, folks. It is not looking good. We are playing the best team. But let's see if we can... Uh... We've got to get something going here. We've got to see. Ooh, big return on the 40. And let's. Ooh. I think we've. I've just got to work on doing some. Some craziness over here. I really. I. I'm definitely going to be working on my passing on. Two yards. I I definitely need to get the controls. We're definitely gonna go for it. There's only 12 seconds left. We're gonna try to hit. Bro. I I don't know what's if I think the biggest issue is I'm like when I release it, it like moves it from where I'm trying to trying to throw it to, and it just completely whiffs on the throw. So that's something that I gotta try to figure out. This is kind of this is kind of a difficult game, I won't lie. <laughs> or I'm just ass at it. I think I'm just ass. And I also don't exactly have a good team. Wow. Alright, we gotta throw it again here. And this dude's so slow. Every... Jeez, dude, what the hell? All right, that was actually a good pass, and of course they don't throw it. But we've got to hit our top wide receiver. He's going to start streaking. Oh, he's open. I, I'm not, I don't know if I suck at this game or if my team sucks, but. Oh, they missed a 47 yarder. We're still in this. We got to go, though. If we, if we want a chance to win, I like the separation at the top. At the top. Oh my god. So even all right. I think my team is just ass. 
There we go. Finally, now we're now we're talking. Now we're talking. Finally, make a 10-yard passing play. <laughs> New record, longest passing play for 14 yards. There we go. That's what we need. We've got to get we've got to get it going here. All right, we like him at the bottom. We like him at the bottom. Dude, these dudes can't catch. Um. Oh. Oh. I, I didn't. They are very sensitive on the uh, the swiping. One yard, first down. Oh my, that was. I need to like maybe I'm not exactly using my thumb, so maybe that'll help. Or... All right, we at least we're catching the ball on this drive. We are we are making big big uh big moves from he's gonna cut in, caught. There we go, there we go, touchdown. Finally, we are all right. That's what we needed to start the third. Get a defensive stop, and we've got a chance to win this game. Twenty-five yard pass and play. That was actually really nice. There we go. There we go. One or two point conversion. Let's go for the one. And we're going to miss this. We are going to miss this. No good. I knew it. I knew it. Honestly, they, they kind of got me shook because I was not expecting there to be dudes kind of rushing me because they didn't uh, they didn't show that in the, uh, the, the tutorial. But. It's a fumble! Houston has possession! That's what we needed. This is massive. And you already know who I'm going to. I'm going to BF. BF for the... BF! Oh, I should have... Should have tried to punch it up a little bit. Uh, first and goal. Let's hand it to a running back and see if he can do anything. Two yards. Two yards. He got a nice two-yarder. Let's, let's hit him again. Yeah, touchdown. Touchdown. All right, now we're going to be up by 12. It makes sense to go for one. It does. No good, huh? It's good, finally. All right, score a one-point conversion with that achievement. We'll, we'll take that. It's a throw over the middle. Incomplete Indianapolis punt. Houston in their own half. That's a good return. Houston has possession. All right. We've got to just keep running the ball we can't fumble though we cannot fumble what an upset stay in four yards all right and now we've got to let's see if we can oh five yards and that's that's game i think i think that's game stiff arm for one that was a lot of running for only one yard I mean, we've just got to keep running the ball. Play for third down or... What, what, what kind of question is that? We're up by three. Why the hell would we... Why would we kick a field goal? Um, I think we go for fourth down. I really do. See, this dude's so damn slow. Interception, wow. With one second, but... Yeah, that was a... Yeah, that was a bad play. It was a little short. That was on me, but... Let's see what they do with one second. Has it at midfield. The quarterback airs it out. Game over with a dub. First game as the coach, and of course we're copping a dub. We got a few CCs. Achievement win a game. All right, so obviously not not in the hunt or even a division leader. We we're we're struggling there at three and fourteen, but we'll check the results. Who else won? Tennessee beat the Jags. Playoffs. The playoffs. Are my Bears doing anything? No, they're not doing. They're not doing squat. All right, but well, let's continue on. And what would you say to the fans who are disappointed in the defensive line when Daquan gains today? So we're either going to lose CC or criticize. So 
Huh. Ooh, this is actually tough. I don't want to lose CCs, so I'm actually going to criticize him. I'm going to make him... Yeah, you better get mellow, bro. You better get mellow. But honestly, they played really well, so I... I probably should have kept one around but honestly defense is where we really what well, really looks like we need some some help but all right so i guess this is these are the stats dude had pretty played a pretty bad pretty damn bad game this dude had two he actually had i don't know what the cnd stands for but had a I think the rating is what's most important. He was the... Honestly, we should have been criticizing the damn quarterback. That dude played horrible, but... Luke Wallow's first game in charge of Houston ended with a win against Indianapolis. The Houston fans will be looking forward to the next season now with renewed hope. I hope so. All right, but that is going to wrap it up for us here. Uh, I don't think we're going to be playing through any AFC wildcard games or anything like that. So I think we'll sim through that. Um, but I think there's an off season in this where you might draft somebody or do something. And that's what we'll do in this, uh, the next match or the next episode of this. But we ended up with a dub here. That's a nice, solid dub against the playoff team. We'll see how Indianapolis does if we actually beat a good team or not. But that is going to wrap it up for us here in this Houston Texans Retro Bowl rebuild. Hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.